Watch. Which one did I miss? What? Jack, do you remember the day we met? I'm kind of busy right now, Rose. <laughs> You're right. Sorry. Yeah, I do remember. It was right after I transferred to New York. There are all these tourists around you in front of the Federal Hall. A group of middle-aged Japanese ladies came up and asked me which building it was that King Kong was climbing in the movie. I said it was probably the Chrysler building. And then you showed up and started mouthing off. You were like, no, it's the Empire State. I said the Chrysler building was in Godzilla. <laughs> you idiot. We started arguing and you I forgot all about the idiot. tourists. I was insisting that I was right and you were doing the same. The next thing we knew, the Japanese women had gone away, and we ended up going to the Skyscraper Museum to see who had the better recall. We argued all the way to Battery Park. And for nothing. Since the museum was closed, we went our separate ways from the museum. And then I found you again by coincidence out in the base corridor. An amazing coincidence I love this music. that we were actually working at the same place. That night we went up to the top of the Empire State. It was so beautiful. I could look down on the Chrysler building from 120 stories above ground. I felt overwhelmed. I didn't care anymore who was right. And that was our first date. We watched King Kong in your apartment a bunch of times that night. Didn't sleep till morning. Hmm. If it weren't for that coincidence, we wouldn't be together. I know. I'm sorry, Jack. I'm taking up your time again. You sure are. Take care. I'm disposing of bombs. I could die. Hey, baby. Okay. God, do I really want to go back through that room again? Why do I keep thinking the map's on the touchpad? Is it because every other game has the map in the touchpad? So he's going to probably get t uh, tipped off to that, but he has a dart in him already. What's he going to do about it? There we go. God, I have to go back through the bad room again. I don't want to go back through the bad room. I always die in the bad room. Okay, so it's not this one. Is the bomb literally in the bad one? Oh, fuck off. Going that way. He's not gonna turn around, so I don't need to waste another dart on him. These poor guards. How many darts have I shot them with today? How bad is that for them? Oh. That's because the uh, darts are slow. It's not because I'm bad at aiming. Uh, I think I just hit him. We're gonna do it again. Okay. <laughs> Oh man. Hey kids, if you are uh, if you're laughing at how bad at this I am right now, it'll happen to you. It'll happen to you. One day, 30 years from now, you'll uh, boot up your Fortnites and you won't find the experience very poggers. You too will feel the phantom tax. I keep trying to open the fucking map. Okay, it is this strut. I have sensor A out. I'll bet you it is on the roof. Oh, you know what? I actually think I vaguely remember where it is on the roof. Oh god, this guy's still here. Oh, what's that? Oh, you guys are such pieces of shit. You're all pieces of shit, and I don't like you. Oh god, he's right there. And boom goes the dynamite. Okay, let's go back up and waste more darts on more idiots. I love these guards. I shouldn't make fun of them. Where the fuck is it, though? That's weird. I knocked this guy out at the top of the stairs, and he's over here now. Don't wake up. Like 
I'm not sure if indirect deaths count as kills. I think they do. Like, if you shoot somebody and he falls off a cliff. Like, you trank them, I should say, and then they fall off a cliff, knocked out. It is under the Harrier. I didn't see it. I thought I remembered that, but... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm becoming derizzed. There we go. That hit. I see it. I see this motherfucker. There we go. Right in here. The C4 reported on the roof of Strut E has been taken care of. Explosives were planted on the Harrier 2 stationed on the roof. Good work. Only one more left to go. This is Pliskin. Do you read me, Pete? I'm here. Things What's are about to go bad. You need to hear this, too. I'm listening. I checked out the bottom of Strut H for you, Pete. Wait, what's this about? I asked Pliskin to look around. Knowing Fat Man, I can't shake the feeling that all the bombs so far were just wrong. So did you find anything? Yeah, a hell of a lot of C4s packed into the bottom of the strut. Pete called it right. I knew he had the real thing up his sleeve. So all the other ones were dummies? No, they're a threat, all right. But the detonation wouldn't be enough to destroy the entire shell. But the C4s Pliskin found would inflict serious structural damage. That's not the bad news either. These are sensor proof. What? New model, I guess. These are not the stinky bombs. The sensor can't detect them. The whole thing is sealed tight to prevent vapor leak, and there's no trace of that cologne signature. Pete, looks like he fooled you. Yes. But you managed to find the thing anyway. It was sheer luck. Bombs that are invisible to the sensor? Any ideas, Pete? Are there more out there? I will see for myself. You can't move fast enough. He's right. I can try You're to spray. You're a cripple. Hold on. There's something not right about this one. I can feel it. Well, Pete, should I come back and get you? No, there's no need. Raiden, you have one left to go, correct? Right, except for those scentless ones. How about you, Pliskin? I have two left, not counting this one. Okay. It'll have to be me. I have the level four card that'll get me into shell two in any case. Yeah, you let's use the bomb disposal expert to dispose of the bombs. For sure. That won't happen. I, I can walk just fine. I can even run. What do you mean? That bomb five years ago. I messed up. Even with all my experience, I lost it. And the church was lost in the explosion. All those kids playing nearby too. <laughs> These past five years, I've lived a lie. Lied? Yes, lied. I didn't lose my leg in the explosion. Uh, so many dead. I feel like All that'd be a really hard thing to fake. <laughs> All I could think about was hiding from the crime, shielding myself from the public outcry. I wanted people to be sorry for me, for my weakness. What a piece of shit. <laughs> I faked being a victim myself because I couldn't bear to face the families of the real victims. This is no prosthetic. I can keep my footing on catwalks and hike over deserts. I live my life so well. I do it all the time. Answer to myself for my sins. It was supposed to be a shield, and it's become a shroud instead. I've killed my soul by playing the victim. Instead of protecting me, it's made my life even more hellish. What good can that do the victims? I know. I'm a coward. <laughs> yeah, he is. God forgive me. I can walk with my own two feet, and I need them to stop Fat Man. His crimes are also I mine. I need them to kick one his ass. mission and arrogance. No one should teach the skills I taught him without a clear conscience. This is the only way I can defuse my own sins. I get you, Pete. That one's all yours. You got it, Raiden? I understand. I'm still kind of thinking care about, about how much of a piece of shit he is, but I'm sure I can do it. Too. I wouldn't recommend you go into any of the other struts. I owe you one. I'll get back to freezing the baby bombs then. You do that too, right? I'm on it. I'll have the radio with me if you need to get in touch. Just don't ask for Peg Leg Peter. He's gone for good. I wouldn't do that anyway, baby. That's disrespectful. <laughs> Old Peg Leg Peter. Alright, let me just. Let me just slide in here. 
I, I, can I open this hatch? I don't remember. No, I can't. And is there a box up here? Did I already grab that? I think I might have. Good, good, good. Alright, I'm leaving. Fuck this. Whoa, that was weird. <laughs> the game just stopped. There may be a few issues in this collection. That's all good. I almost cartwheeled down. You will not be an issue any further. I think I'm gonna go this way. Goodbye, babies. Alright, alright, alright. Now, Binocular Man should still be asleep, and we'll be fine. God damn it. And this should take me out on the top floor of the next strut, which is good, so I don't get spotted by all those motherfuckers again. Should I be saving my M9 ammo? Probably. Okay. There we go. Ooh, you're here, eh? That was close. By the way, you don't have to hit them in the head, you can just hit them in the chest. And that does just fine. Why does that guy look like he's on this floor on the radar? That threw me off. There you are. I should really just start dragging the guards I knock out to get some M9 ammo, because holy shit. I need it in a bad way. Oh yeah, there we go. Thanks, buddy. Exactly what I wanted. So okay, the last bombs. The last melon. Wait for this motherfucker. Don't turn. <laughs> That's why we need it so bad. Uh, wake up for a minute, baby. Okay. Um, hmm. This is the one, right? Oh, strut B. I'm an idiot. Yeah, okay. That's not a big deal. That's fine. I'm still glad we went this way. I forgot we didn't get strut B's bomb. I even said we were going to wait to get it. And I still didn't get it. Oh, shit. What's wrong with me? There we go. Okay. Let's just take some of these things out. Oh. There we go. So we got one bomb over here. Fuck off. I thought there was another one over here, but maybe that's only on extreme? Your turn. There we go. Let's take care of it. Okay. And that's some bombs. I have the last C4 frozen. There's nothing showing up on the sensor now. Good work, Raiden. You're way ahead of me, kid. I still have one to go. How's your bomb, Peter? It's a bomb, all right. Sealed C4 and in That's huge good. quantities. That's good to know. You think there's another one in Shell 1? For sure. Somewhere at the bottom of Strut A. Why are you so certain? If this bottom section of the strut is demolished, Shell 2 will be well on its way to destruction. You mean that Shell 2 will actually sink? Not immediately. There'll still be five struts left. But if Shell 1 loses a strut at the same time, it'll be a very different story. The big shell's structural integrity depends on a very exact balance. If both shells lose a strut each, the whole structure will tear itself apart under its own weight. What do we do? I have a sensor that can locate even those scentless C4s. It makes combined use of a neutron scintillator and a hydrogen bomb detector. 
You brought that stuff with you? Of course. I made the calibrations while I was in the pantry. Does it work? I just tested it, and it definitely responds. But the best I can do is a sound beacon, not the radar. Sound? The shorter the interval between beacons, the closer the target. I get you. There's another one in that pantry I was in. You can go back and get it. It's all yours, Ryden. I'm going to study it some more and see if the freezing process will work. Don't touch the other one until I say so. Okay. I'll stand by until you radio in. It'll all go smoothly. Nothing could ever go wrong. Okay. Right. I forgot I had to go to the strut first. That's what they just said. Got distracted by a text message. Glad we didn't walk all the way to strut one first. Strut A. Okay. Let's go grab that thing. Now that Stillman's eating all the food in the pantry. Peter, I have sensor B. Good. Head to the bottom of strut A. How's your invisible bomb? I'm looking at it, but I'm keeping my distance. How's Pliskin doing? A few more minutes. I just got to the last strut, but there are a few enemy sentries I have to take care of. Does it look bad, Peter? Maybe. It's an odd one. The detonator hasn't been activated. What? But the sensors are live. Which means... This is Pliskin. I've located the last C4. Is that it? I'm about to freeze it. Then... Wait! Pliskin! <laughs> no. You, you still have time to stop. Now it's too hey, late. That was it! What's going on? The detonator just woke up. It's counting down! What happened? Snake, why didn't the you just stop when he asked you to? Activated when all the baby C4s went offline. Right. I mean, plus the one and shell one should be counting down too. Hurry! What's the remaining time? Three hundred seconds. Three hundred seconds? That dialogue changes depending right. on what difficulty Move. you're on. Get to the bottom of strut A now. If you're on easy, you get four hundred seconds. Okay, let's go get them bombs. Really, even if I was at the furthest possible strut, which, yeah, I'm not, um, 300 seconds is more than enough time. I feel like you only get 200 if you're on uh, extreme, but it's been a while, so I don't quite remember that. I feel like we haven't been on this bridge in a very, very long time because we kept going to those uh, sides that killed us. It's a force of habit. I don't know why I'm doing that. Oh, boy. Uh, in Metal Gear 1, I don't remember if I talked about this in the MGS1 playthrough, but in Metal Gear 1, the MSX game, there's a part where you're trying to escape outer heaven during a time limit. And uh, no matter how many times I did the run, I could not get out in time and I was like this seems impossible I, did, I cut every corner I could I made it out as quick as I could and it still wasn't enough time for me to escape and it turns out that the solution is to go into your inventory and click the use right. button on your cigarettes and Listen. eat them like a ration Listen. and then your counter goes up what is it so I'm glad we got away from that fell for what that man has my number a proximity trigger microwave M microwave with a seven foot range it's not a technique I taught him. Neither was that multi-bomb booby trap. Looks like he's far surpassed me as far as explosives technique goes. As for the rest... Pete, get the hell out of there. There's less than 30 seconds left. It's too late. No. You were just bragging about how you can run. Just do it. From strut H as fast as you can. Pete! Right! Keep your distance. Use the spray from as far away as possible. Me? You can do it. I know that. I'm not so sure. But I am. Do it. I know you can. I'm just going to wait for this bomb now. There it is. How loud would that be in your ear? Like, on the other end of the codec. I mean, not, not in Stillman's ears. Okay, let's get this thing. Oh, yeah, I don't want sensor A. I want sensor B. B, B, B. All right. 
so I don't think this one is where it normally is. And what I mean by that is on the normal difficulty and easy difficulty, it's on the bottom of the submarine. I don't think it's there in this. I don't remember where it is. Is it there? Yeah, it's not there. Okay. It was beeping a lot over here. Where is it? I don't remember at all, actually. This is exciting. Do I have to crawl for it? I might. I might have to crawl for it. Maybe this isn't enough time, guys. Maybe we're screwed. I think I have to go through here. This seems vaguely familiar. I think I have to crawl through here. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. There it is. It's, it is on the other side of the submarine. I don't know if I can reach it from over here. I feel like that's a different part of the submarine that it's normally on, though. Is that hitting? That's not hitting. Uh, can I just get under here? Maybe I can hit it from over here. I got more than enough time. Okay, okay. So yeah, I think it's on a different part of the submarine that I wouldn't be able to reach from that side. Not that I can hit it from this side. Okay. I mean, I totally know what I'm doing. Because it's normally in that middle part. But, ah, there we go. How do I get at that? Huh. It's puzzle time. It's puzzle time. Can I hit it from here? No, I don't think so. Maybe I do have to crawl back under. <laughs> We'll figure this out. We're good. We're good. This seems right. This seems better. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Right? Oh, I hear it. It's working. Stress you out, didn't I? I wasn't worried Colonel, for a second. I've neutralized the bomb. Good work, Raiden. It was a great loss for everyone. Yes, it was. Colonel. Any damage report on the explosion? Seems that the duct for diverting the contaminated seawater was destroyed. And the central section of Shell 2 is flooding. The explosions ignited the oil slick on the surface. What about the toxins? The chemicals stayed in containment. Toxin. There's no immediate danger. Is the big shell stable? Shell 1 was unaffected. The price was high. But the threat of the bomb is over for now. What's the next objective? Rescue the President. Get back to the upper Seems level. Seems easy. Roger that. Okay. This seems like a good place to call it for the day. Thank you all for joining me. Um, just let me get to this. Let's see if Rose has any advice for us. What's up, Jack? So, looks like you remembered I'm still here after all. Jesus. Huh? I thought you'd completely forgotten that I existed. Of course not. What's wrong with you? It's just, you haven't seen... This is why I don't call long. her very often. That doesn't mean I forgot. Is that so? And didn't you think I'd be worried? But... I was really worried. You're okay, right? Yeah. Good. 